Arena Monterey is traditionally one of the toughest places to play in indoor soccer, but with new owner Jim Lindenberg in attendance, the Wave put up a historic victory there in their season opener Sunday night. The Wave opened the scoring in the first quarter as a turnover, this time forced by J.P. Rodrigues, leads to the Canadian give-and-go, Kit to Jules, back to Kit for the first score, the Wave are on top 2-0. That defensive pressure would be a recurring theme the rest of the night. Four minutes later, a double team along the boards forces the ball free. Travis McKenzie with a deft little touch to Ryan Mack who goes high. Mack's first goal is a member of the wave, and all of a sudden, Milwaukee's on top, 4-0. Mack is also involved in the wave's third goal of the first quarter, leaving it in space for Brett Wiesner, who runs onto it, takes a touch, and fires past Jose Bonte, putting the wave on top, 6-0. Brett then gives us the first memorable goal celebration of the year with a little dance and the wave are rolling. The fourth goal is largely the work of Canadian speedster Ian Bennett. Digs the ball out along the boards, flies down the left side and leaves it in the middle for streaking Everton, who chips it over Bonte and the wave at the end of the first quarter are leading Monterey 8 to nothing. Nick Vorberg got great defensive support in keeping the sheet clean through three quarters, but when needed, made the saves he had to, like this blast from Victor Quiroz along the left wing. Monterey went to the sixth attacker with about eight minutes left, thought they got on the board on this finish from Chile Farias, but it was a two-line pass by Quiroz, the sixth attacker, and no goal allowed. Under four minutes left now on Monterey with one last glimmer of hope, a six-on-four advantage. That lasts a grand total of 11 seconds. Brett Wiesner steals the pass at midfield. Knocks home the empty net three-pointer for an 11-0 lead. All that's left now is for the Wave to finish the first road shutout in team history. Before it can be final, the Wave had a couple of garbage time goals. Everton cleans up the mess for Marco Terminesi to go up 13-0. Then Bennett shows off great speed and footwork, taking the pass from Giuliano Oliviero in his own end, getting down inside the three-point line and finishing for that 15-0 advantage. Monterey's best chance to avert the shutout may have been its last. With just a couple of ticks left, a shot from beyond the three-point arc is denied by Vorberg appropriately. And now it's time for the hugs. Wave 15, Monterey nothing. Vorberg owns a historic W.